It's normal nowadays for a royal to marry a commoner, but 55 years ago everyone was shocked when Prince Harald of Norway suddenly announced that he was going to marry a dressmaker. For many years they kept their relationship a secret and struggled for love. What happened to them 55 years later and how are they doing today? Keep watching to find out. This is WOW channel. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for notifications. Let's begin! The fate of the future king of Norway, Prince Harald, was predetermined from birth. He was born in 1937 as the only son of the royal family. From childhood he was prepared for the fact that one day he would marry a girl of royal descent and inherit the throne. In those days the royal families valued tradition. Noble people could choose as a spouse only a person of their social circle. But Prince Harald went against tradition for the sake of love. Young Prince first met Sonia Haraldsson in 1959 at a party in Oslo. They were 22 years old and fell in love immediately. Two months later he invited her to his graduation ball. There they were photographed together for the first time. At that moment they could not openly tell everyone about their feelings, because Sonia was a commoner and was not fit for the prince's wife. At first the royal family did not pay attention to this love affair because they thought that this relationship would end soon. Everyone believed that Sonia was just a short affair in the prince's life. Sonia Haraldson did not have royal titles, she was from a simple family. Her father was just a clothing merchant. After graduating from her lower secondary school, the girl entered a vocational school where she learned dressmaking and tailoring. She also studied in Switzerland where she learned accounting, fashion design and social science. Sonia received her bachelor's degree from the University of Oslo and spoke several foreign languages. She had a good education, refined manners and an excellent reputation. However, for all the noble citizens in Norway she was still a commoner. People were embarrassed by the fact that she worked in a clothing store. In those days it seemed unthinkable that the future king would marry an ordinary dressmaker. However, despite prejudice, Prince Harald continued to date Sonia Haraldsson. Their secret love affair lasted nine years. During this time they passed the test of their feelings and realized that they could not live without each other. One day the prince asked his father, Olav V, for permission to get married, but got rejected. Then the prince told his father that if he was not allowed to marry Sonia, he would never marry at all. The royal family was worried about this statement, because Harald was the only heir to the throne in the male line. If he has no heirs, then the royal family of Norway will cease to exist. After much debate and thought, the king nevertheless allowed Harald to marry Sonia. Their wedding took place in 1968. On that day the whole of Oslo was decorated with flowers and flags. The ceremony in the cathedral was attended by about 850 people. The newlyweds were greeted by ordinary residents outdoors. Thousands of people accepted this union with delight, because the story of Sonia was like a fairy tale about Cinderella. People sincerely rejoiced for her and wished for happiness. It seemed that no one cared about the fact that the girl was a commoner. The main thing was that the prince married for love, and Sonia was perfect for the role of his wife, as she was smart, educated and beautiful. Another girl received the title of Crown Princess of Norway. Courtiers began to call her Royal Highness. The princess started to take an active part in the social life of her country together with her husband. She was involved in establishing a fund which provides assistance to disabled children in Norway. Also Sonia has taken active part in large-scale initiatives to raise funds for international refugees and served as Vice President of the Norwegian Red Cross. 
Three years after their marriage, they had a daughter, Princess Martha Louise, and a couple of years later, they welcomed their son, Prince Hakon, who is the next heir to the throne. In 1991, Harold became king after the death of his father, and his wife, Sonia, became queen consort, and they are still on the throne. Today King Harold is 86 years old and Queen Consort Sonia is 85. It's hard to believe that 55 years have passed since their wedding, and it's been 64 years since they first met. Their love story is probably the most impressive in the European royal monarchy. They fought for love for many years and proved that feelings are more important than prejudice. Harold and Sonia were ahead of their time because in those days everyone was against the marriage of a commoner and a prince. However, their story has shown that marriages created for love are more reliable and durable than unions of convenience. Do you agree with me? Thanks for watching! Don't forget to share your thoughts with me, to click like and to subscribe. See you next time!